Your calls today on Sports Station appear via the GM OnStar hotline. With OnStar turn-by-turn -turn navigation, just a push of the button, and the advisor downloads directions to your vehicle. One year of OnStar, standard on the 2008 Chevy Malibu. Learn more at OnStar.com. Coming up in 10 minutes, it's going to be your time to stamp it. But up next, more from Omar Minaya's press conference. Why did he pull the trigger on firing Will Randolph? We'll hear it straight from the GM's mouth. Along with the rest of Distraught, I'm John Seibel. Join the Sports Nation online at USBNRadio.com. What if I told you you could magically erase all the flaws in your skin? The acne, the dark circles, rosacea, birth marks, any imperfection. Wrong. You've got to up those beats per minute of BPM to really crush the towers in there. Correct. Ooh. Live strong, everyone. Get Nike Plus and the Live Strong Collection at Dick's Sporting Goods, the home of Nike training. Hola! We're the 2008 Nicaragua team. <laughs> a group of 20 of us are going down to Managua, Nicaragua uh, to work with a missionary family who's been there for 10 years uh, to help the people um, who live in and off of the dump. Um, we're really excited and we thank all of you who supported us and we ask for your prayers. When we get there we'll be staying with a missionary family. During the day we'll be doing construction projects, soccer camps, VBS, music ministry and just having fun serving in the name of Christ. Hi Deer Creek Congregation, thank you so much for um, your prayers and your support financially for us so far and we're here we are the night before and we're packing and getting ready to go. We just have a few prayer, prayer requests that we'd like you to pray for us as we're there. Firstly, just that God would be glorified. Um, we've been reading this book uh, by John Piper and just encouraging us that missions is not the ultimate thing, but worship is, and that we want the world to come to worship the living God. And so we want God to be glorified in everything we do. Uh, the second thing is um, just pray for the Nicaraguans. Pray that we'll have effective witness to them, that we'll be sensitive to their culture, that God would open up their hearts to hear the good news that would be the love of Christ to them. And lastly, just pray for our students. Um, they go for all kinds of different reasons and just pray that God will make them lifelong mission seekers, um, that they'll seek to bring the gospel to the world for the rest of their lives. While covering every limit in this